How many years have you been in Vice, Roy? More years than I want to own up to, Phelps. You have any idea who Rojas was talking about? The gringo runs the operation? Could be anybody. You don't expect those morons to be running the show, do you? You ask Roas how much a silver dollar is worth, he'd probably say 50 cents. Sit tight. Let's take a look at what's going on. Either these customers are serious soup lovers, or I think we found our middleman. Car 11 King to KGPL. Car 11 King, go ahead. I'm requesting assistance in a B wagon at 20th Century Markets, 1558 North Highland. Numerous narcotic suspects. Code 2 only, no sirens. 11K, roger. Okay. Cavalry should be here any minute. LAPD, nobody move! I'll take my chances. Whatever you're carrying, hand it over. I'd say he's got about half a can left. I guess that makes me a pessimist. You can't take me in. Take you in? Be glad he didn't shoot you. I wouldn't have chased you. If it was up to me, you'd be talking out of a hole in the back of your I head. I want information. Senor, I would like to help you. But I got a family in Mexico I have to provide for. And my compadres are very unreasonable. Your compadres? Turn out your pockets. I need Ray to run down these silver dollars. I need to make a deal. I need guarantees. You have identification? Sanchez Erto, Mexican, Tijuana address. Here's the deal, Erto. You give me information, and I won't give you to immigration. Give me EJ, the driver bringing in the shipments, or I'll make you for it. I run the shop. That's all I do. Tell me the goddamn truth. You are in this with the others. I told you I know them. I told you my family's at risk. What makes me part of their gang? You have a silver dollar, Erto, just like Juan. I'm sure Ernesto and the rest have them as well. The silver dollars are his mark. Whose? Give me a name. None of us are allowed to see him. 
His creatures carry His odors to us. If I gave you His name, I would be buried alongside my wife and children. If you don't give us something, you will rot in jail while your family starves on the street. Ernesto Juarez, tonight at 1 a.m. He's bringing the truck into the soup factory. Please help me, sir. Ernesto can be very cruel. Tell me about the soup cans. The soup is very popular, as you can see. It's a real funny, wise guy. You want to try saying that again with no teeth? I get a delivery at 7.30 every other day from the factory. Jorge organizes everything. We know about Jorge and Juan. Juan is dead. Tell us how you know the Cruz boys. Ernesto put together this thing. He brought in Juan, Juan brought in Jorge. Continue. I was already here. Ernesto knows I'm illegal, so he threatened to report me if I didn't help. And the money is good. The gringos and the gringas, they love the reefer. And I didn't want to have to leave and start again in San Francisco. You're breaking my heart. You're under arrest, Erto. I'll speak to the DA and see if he will agree to not seize your assets or deport you. That's the best I can do. Freddie said they were moving 50 pounds a week. That's a lot of soup cans. I think this is an interstate operation. Moving dope around the country to selected grasshoppers. Local weed gets distributed in the usual way, through Pachuco street punks. Someone must know something about this drug baron character. Here they come. Let him unload the goods first. Now? Let's get him. Move. Move! Let's go! I got your back. LAPD, put your hands where we can see them! Go, Phelps! Get in there! Reinforcements are on the way! See? <laughs> Move. Move! I got your back. LAPD, put your hands where we can see them. Go, Phelps. Get in there. Goddamn cover! Throw out the guns! Clear me some 
base here. I think that's the last of them, Cole. Detectives, found something here you probably want to see. Tijuana address. We should see what the Federales have on him. Per dead man. Doesn't seem like much for a human life. God damn. I think we found our stash, Cole. Take a look in these boxes. Very minimum, another 50 pounds. Detectives, I think we got the guy. Does the name Cruz mean something to you? It certainly does. Yet another silver dollar. Must be a thousand dollars here. Phelps, Earl, looks like quite a bloodbath. What was this all about? Drugs and money, what else? Speaking of money, where did that roll go? I picked it up for safekeeping. The department owes me 50. Ray. I have another two coins for you. Great. I've got something to show you. It's all set up on the table over here. There. Take a look at these coins you've been collecting. There are letters cut into each coin, along with not legal tender. What does it mean? Those are Morgan silver dollars from the 20s. They were removed from circulation and sent for disposal. A number of smelters around the country had the contract. Look at them together. Can you work out what it says?
first coin, M-A-S, the second, A-N-G, the third, K-A-Y, the fourth, M-E-T, the fifth, A-L-S, Mesenke Metals. A metal foundry. Would you like the address? Would I ever. 1034 Vine Street, Hollywood. We'll finish up here. It's already been a long night, Phelps. See if you can talk them into giving themselves up. I hope that big wad of cash doesn't weigh you down. It's your priority, Straight Phelps. We're close to bringing in one of the biggest dope cases of the year, and you're worrying about unsubstantial evidence?
Riker's Riker. That cop They covered it up. Some kind of big conspiracy. For the back door, Roy. How long do you think you can hold out? and your hands in the air. You're surrounded, and your buddies are there. Shit, really hurts. Your 
move, mister! Victor Sanders. You know this guy? I should have known. Of course I know Roy. Roy and I have had an arrangement for Get many up. years. You're under arrest. Am I? This we have a mountain of prima facie evidence, as well as the testimony. You'd be surprised how things have a habit of sorting themselves out. Evidence disappearing. Witnesses that can't be found. Policemen that forget. The impossible becomes probable when you have a client list like mine. Shut your mouth! Turn around and put your hands behind your back. Working vice can be a thankless task, Phelps. But on behalf of the brass and the moms and dads and the concerned citizens, I'd like to commend you and your partner for smashing this dope ring. Reefer is almost as big a threat to the children of this city as communism. What about Sanders, Lieutenant? Leave Sanders to me, Phelps. The chief will be looking after that one personally. He will be brought to trial. Phelps, we are celebrating your success. Don't push your luck. Sanders is no longer your problem. <laughs> 